Sairam children let us now listen to the story of the unhappy crow In a far off forest lived a crow that seemed to be very satisfied and happy with his life He was happy with the way he looked and the way his life was spent One day however the crow was flying around the forest when he met a swan The crow could not help but stop and stare at the swan because he had never seen a bird so beautiful before he could not help but talk to the bird and say ah, ah, you must be the happiest bird in the forest because you are so beautiful if you think i am the most beautiful then you have not seen a parrot yet he has two beautiful colors but as i am just plain white replied the swan a few days later as the crow was flying around he came across the parrot the swan had mentioned when the crow looked at the beautiful colors of the parrot do you know what he said you must be the happiest bird in the forest because you are so beautiful i was a very happy bird but then i saw the peacock the peacock has so many colors i only have two kee kee replied the parrot sadly now the crow was very curious to see the peacock and admire his beauty for himself so he flew far away from the forest to see where he could find a peacock one day he finally found him the crow was amazed looking at the way the peacock spread his feathers so many people had gathered around the peacock and were also watching him spread his beautiful feathers and they were admiring his beauty soon when the crowds dispersed the crow approached the peacock and do you know what he said <coughs> you must be the happiest bird alive You have such magnificent colors and such beautiful feathers. So many people want to look at you and admire you. Ha <coughs> ha! Ah! cried the peacock. How can I be happy about my colors when I am here trapped in the zoo and cannot even roam freely because of these colors? Sometimes I wish I was a crow. You my friend are the only bird who is not caged and I would trade these colors for some freedom any day It was only after the peacock spoke that the crow realized that comparing himself with other birds was not right because he has his own blessings The moral of the story is accept the way you are and what you are consider yourself and your life as a prasadam from our beloved lord jai sai ram